1411, the figure that shocked us all. It was unthinkable, only 1411 tigers left in the country, where a century ago 40,000 used to roam. We were down to only 1411 according to the census. NDTV and SL came together and launched the first edition of the Save Our Tigers campaign. We got tremendous support from citizens and children across the country. We even raised 5 crores for rapid response units to help protect tigers. Seventeen oh six, the number that made a difference. In 2011, the Fresh Tiger Census gave us a new number. The tiger population had gone up to an estimated 1706, the number that gave us hope. More was being done for tiger conservation, new tiger reserves had been declared, steps were being taken to protect the national animal better. And the most positive sign was how concerned everyone was about the fate of the tiger, a symbol of India's forests and wildlife. Year 2 of the NDTV SL Save Our Tigers campaign once again saw the most prominent faces in conservation and entertainment come together for a united cause. 29th of July was World Tiger Day and the day that once again saw youth and concerned citizens come out and make a difference. Across the country people signed up to support our tiger agenda. The third edition of the SLND TV Save Our Tigers campaign began its journey by drawing up a six-point tiger agenda for the protection of our national animals. The agenda was decided by experts and our campaign partners, ASL, Sanctuary Asia and Wildlife Conservation Trust. The tiger agenda made six crucial demands that will be taken to chief ministers of key tiger states. What we're demanding in the tiger agenda? Involve local communities in conservation strengthen and modernize forest departments to step up protection, improve man-animal conflict mitigation measures, the protection of buffer zones and corridors must be increased, a zero-tolerance approach towards poaching, and make political parties accountable for the loss of biodiversity. On World Tiger Day, we asked you to show your support for the tiger. We had tiger hubs across the country where people came and signed up for our agenda and school children who had collected signatures for the campaign also submitted them to us. We were joined by eminent personalities and we collected over 5 lakh signatures. Let's just take a look back at how the day unfolded. So we are across uh, India right now. We'll be going across to Monidipa who's in Calcutta and uh, Saurabh in Bombay as well as uh, Sam who joins us from Chennai and uh, if you can't make it to our, these locations and sign up to support our agenda, well, you can just log on to ndtv.com slash tiger and sign up as well. Now joining us here is someone who needs no introduction whatsoever. Kiran Bedi has come here to support the NDTV SS Save Our Tigers campaign. Thank you so much and thanks for supporting the campaign. Well, I am supporting environment. I'm a part of that environment. So I'm supporting myself. Absolutely. And, and, uh, we have so many children who are a part of this campaign, who've been collecting signatures, our tiger agenda, and really to have you here is such, a, such an inspiration for them. Absolutely. I think that this is what sensitization is all about. Early on, that it's a, it's a collective world. It's a united world. We can't live in isolation. We're interconnected world. It's a human world. I think that's what, once they learn, we understand in interconnectivity, Absolutely. that animal, human being relationship changes. In Chennai, children were surprised by Khushbu and in Kolkata, we were joined by actor Rituparna Sen Gupta. Last time when we met you for the same tiger campaign, your children, you explained to us how much they love tiger. We have many little children who have joined us today to express their support and solidarity. They've come with their paintings and slogans. How important is to bring up that kind of an awareness, raise their awareness at a very young age? I think the day we start schooling, it's uh, the minute it comes for T, A, B, C, D, A, T for tiger is what we are taught. So I think that's where actually the training for the kids should start, that L for lion, T for tiger. So you need to protect these animals. They are the pride of a country. They are the pride of this earth, actually. And uh, when we take a when you look at a tiger, you feel oh wow. When you look at a lion, and you're like oh wow, what a beauty. So I think you need to bring bring up the kids and say that you need to protect the animals. Rituparna, welcome and thank you so much for coming here. Starting with why? Thank you so much, Manidipa. Actually, 
I always supported this cause and I feel that this is the most apt cause and uh, this uh, tiger conservation should have been more, uh, uh, you know, it, it should have been uh, in this, um, you know, we should initiate this even more. But uh, I believe that there is a lot of response nowadays, uh, you know, coming up for this cause. In Bangalore, children from the Kids for Tigers initiative were taken on a special nature trail and given a talk on wildlife photography by wildlife conservation legend TNA Perumal. You've been meeting with the young children today. You're saying it's a two-way experience. What were you? What is the key of the message that you were just telling? Them? The message is they must have the inquisitiveness to up appreciate, understand, or study natural history about our ants, about our spiders, and it just starts like that. You've been lucky enough to listen to this wonderful photographer. What have you been learning from him today? Uh, like, uh, we knew uh, what uh, he actually was. Uh, like, uh, as we saw for the first time, uh, oh, God, oh my God, he was really scary. Then we thought he's a really friend, friendly man. <laughs> Interacts with kids uh, yeah. more much. And uh, we had a friendly time with him. So are you going to go out and take pictures like this? Yes, ma'am. Ah, great. So we've also had signatures collected as part of the NDTV Air Cell Tiger campaign. We've had signatures collected. And of course, the children here love their interaction with this legendary photographer, Tene Perumal, giving them tips, showing them the beautiful pictures he's taken. It was a lucky day for them on World Tiger Day. As the signatures poured in, so did the tweets. And with your help, we started trending across the country. In Mumbai, the Kids for Tigers team presented us with over one and a half lakh signatures. What's the figure? How many signatures are there in these sheets of paper? This is one lakh sixty-nine thousand and eight hundred signatures that we've got from the Mumbai schools. And Bollywood actress Tara Sharma also joined in to support the campaign. Why is this campaign important to you? Why is it close to your heart? Well, I actually adore tigers and I think now that I have two little sons who honestly on a weekly basis talk about tigers at some point and how much they love them, I'm, I'm more and more aware that we must do as much as we can to conserve tigers, to protect them and I think it kind of translates to all animals and all wildlife because that's the way we can protect, protect our environment and after all we all we are all entitled to this world, it's not just human beings so I think it's very important to save Coming up ahead, we look at how thousands of school children from six cities came together for an art competition to celebrate World Tiger Day and to draw attention to the tiger.